Former Miss Curvy Ireland contestant Katie has seen the world from a height. Now, she's ready to look love straight in the eye. I've been told a lot before that I'm kind of intimidating sometimes to so guys like with the height. I was always like afraid of how tall I was and I'd, I'd like prefer to wear flats and stuff. Like I went for um, Miss Curvy Ireland. I'm meeting loads of other tall women that were beautiful and confident and happy in their skin and yeah, that definitely helped. Hi there. Hi. You're very welcome. I came sixth out of 2,000 applicants. I like what you're wearing, it's nice. Oh, are you sure? Very, yeah, yeah, very colours of the ocean, it's very nice. <laughs> I've always kind of learned that I wanted to be happy by myself first before I settle down or get to know anyone else. Like, so I kind of got to the stage where I'm like, I think I know myself at 27, so. <laughs> or what are you hoping for? Tall, dark and handsome. Smart, intelligent, and I'd like to see myself with someone like small but taller than me, with my heels on. <laughs> Arriving for his appointment at the First States restaurant is med student Daniel, a specialist in anatomy. I like tall women. I like uh, big bums. I um, always have them and like childbearing hips. Hi, hi. You're very welcome, sir. My dad's Nigerian, like I'm half African, and like black guys tend to go for women with sort of larger frames. No. Hi. Hello. How are you? Very well, how are you? What's your name? Katie. Katie, I'm Daniel. Daniel, lovely to meet nice you. To see you. So what accent am I picking up? Uh, sort of a vague Manchester accent. Okay, cool. How about you? I'm from Limerick. That's where I've just come from. Really? Yeah. Are you living in Limerick? I am, yeah. For really? the last two and a half years, yeah. Cool. Yeah. If you'd have said to me when I was 26, 27 that I'd be studying medicine in Ireland, I thought you'd have lost your mind. So you're studying medicine there? Yeah, I've been doing that for the last three and a half years now, so I've got another four months, three or four months, and then... Oh. My love life has been the thing that suffered the most from me doing this, but it's nearly finished, and um, I'm ready to get it back on track. I like football. I played a little bit of basketball when I was at school. Like, yeah, I got, so did I, like, when I was young. I got rubbed I, into it because I was tall, but I'm I not really into it, <laughs> if, I'm, if I'm really being honest. I like Irish girls, and I just think they're beautiful. Thanks very much. I never felt more ready to sort of be in a relationship with someone. Cheers. Cheers. Nice to meet you. And you. I've just realised I completely forgot your name again, which I knew was going I know, on. I've forgotten yours and I've been sat here racking my brain. <laughs> I'm Daniel. Katie. Katie. I knew it was going to happen. I did as well. And I've, I've, I've tried, people have taught me so many techniques, but to be honest, when I meet someone, I just it just goes out of my brain. I never even think of to think of these techniques. Yeah, apparently Daniel, you're supposed to say it Daniel, five times Daniel, over. Daniel, Daniel. Daniel. Katie, Katie, Katie. Daniel, it's done. Katie, right, okay. okay. Sorted. Done. I'll probably forget it. I'm really <laughs> <laughs> if you do, just feel free to ask me. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe to get a regular serving of love and romance.